Hello, my name is Russ Rigo. I'm the founder of Mirror Reflections, and today we're going to demonstrate from beginning to end how to make professional custom molding knives. Okay, today we start at the drawing board. Um, drawing board, oh, sometimes we get samples, uh, wooden samples, uh, sometimes we get samples by fax, sometimes we get samples by dimensions. Uh, today we're going to take a uh, sample by fax and change it, uh, reduce it to scale it and see what we get from there. Uh, two and a half by five eighths is the finished size, so we'll go from there. Okay, we bring this picture into our CAD system. We use MegaCAD, it's a European edition. Alright, this is preliminary drawings. Now we'll just tweak things a little bit, what we think it was supposed to be. Uh, remember, they called off no dimensions. So we just uh, round off to the closest number. This will be 531. Okay, we got the basic foundation. So I believe this is uh, more realistic to what the customer wanted. And then we'll name it. This approval block is what the customer must look at and sign before we'll um, cut any molding knife. Everything must be approved. This will get faxed off to the client. We'll wait for his signature. As soon as we get his signature back, we'll cut the template and then we'll go out and grind the knife. 